Oracle VirtualBox is one of the best and very famous virtualization programs. VirtualBox is a free-to-use and open-source software. This free-to-use virtualization software is designed for three most used operating systems Microsoft Windows. Linux and Mac OS. Oracle VirtualBox is widely used to virtualize another operating system. In simple word, you can use Linux, Android or Mac operating systems inside a Microsoft Windows machine. You can do so on Linux and Mac OS as well. In short, VirtualBox is indeed a very useful piece of software especially for programmers developers and tech researchers. This open source virtualization software saves you both time and money. Though the installation process of VirtualBox is no rocket science, but there are many who find it difficult to download and install Oracle VirtualBox. Taking this into consideration, I've created a short tutorial on where to download VirtualBox from and how to install Oracle VirtualBox on a Windows PC, as well as, the main purpose of making this video is that you cannot use the Jenny Motion Android emulator without installing Oracle VirtualBox. Let's begin the video with system requirements for VirtualBox. As per my personal experience, 1 GB of RAM works great if you want to install Linux and Android operating systems, but you need more than 2 GB of RAM to smoothly run Windows 10, 7, 8 and Mac OS. The best place to download VirtualBox is its official website. Go to virtualbox.org. At left sidebar, click on download page. Since we are installing it on a Windows PC therefore we will be downloading VirtualBox installer for Microsoft Windows. Click on x86 slash am64 next to VirtualBox for Windows hosts. After having downloaded it. Double click on VirtualBox Installer. Click Next, Next, Next. Here you will find a warning that it will temporarily disconnect internet. Keep that in mind before proceeding furthermore and click Yes. Click Install. Click Finish. Congratulations! Now your copy of VirtualBox is ready to use. You can now install your desired operating system. A very important thing, I had already installed it. This is why, you did not see few warnings it gives you while the installation process. All you need to do is click Allow. Please do let me know if you run into any problem. You can use the comment section to ask any question. I'll try to solve your problems as soon as possible. The next video tutorial is on how to download and install Jenny Motion Android emulator. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe make PC Android channel.